talk to yourself and answer as well You read ahead on Walking Dead before you watch the show You eat bread with fur, you still call me sir There's a piece of gum from 91 that's hiding in your purse But no matter what I sing, I wouldn't change a thing you're my postmodern masterpiece You're perfect in the perfect way You're perfect and I hope you stay Your goofy little self eternally Good morning guys, so we're in the store and we are looking for Luis's milk. You say good morning? Say hi! Who's there? Say hi! We're in the grocery store, we had to come look for no Luis's milk and now we are going to look for some coffee. I'm looking for some yummy coffee, something that's different. I mean, we drink, we usually drink like the Starbucks cake cups and stuff like that, but I really want something that's like different. I'm really tired of the same stuff in the morning. What do you think? We had to come for your milk, right? Can you say hi? Say good morning. Can you show them your milk? Is this your milk? This is the om only almond milk that Louisa can drink, and this is the only store we can get it at. So we bought all three containers that were on the shelves. Huh. Yeah, it's this Califia Farms. It's really good. And it's very pure. Yes, we don't have a cup, though, for it. So, yeah. So we're just going to look for some coffee. Oh, this looks good. Mm. Hmm. Cinnabon? That one looks yummy. Nutty hazelnut, vanilla cream pie, extra bold coffee, that looks yummy, Krispy Kreme. Okay, we went with the Javalia Mocha Latte. Yum, it's like a two-step thing, which is what my husband does with the vanilla ones. So. I think I'm going to make chicken fajitas tonight, so let's look and see what we need for chicken fajitas. I'm hoping they have like a fajita seasoning in like a jar instead of like instead of the packets because the packets I feel like you just buy them and use them and I'm not really a fan of those so maybe I'll look and see if there's like a jar. What do you see? What do you see? What's up there? The piñatas. We're in the Mexican food aisle and there are piñatas and she loves this aisle. Huh. Yeah. Huh. We're gonna make fajitas? Can you say fajitas? Can you say fajitas? No. <gasps> oh, or you have to snag a snack. What do you have? Apple. Apple, that's right. Is it yummy? Mm hmm. Alright, guys, the rumor is that pumpkin spice is back. So let's see if. I think they don't know what they call it pumpkin spice at Dunkin' Donuts, but I actually like their pumpkin spice um, as much as I like Starbucks. Sorry, a little frozen in the background. So let's see if they have it yet. Alright, I got it you guys. You can't see, it doesn't say pumpkin, but it is some pumpkin. Mmm, tastes like fall. I bought some Fiesta Lime Mrs. Dash mix. I really like Mrs. Dash just because you can read all the ingredients on the back. And then also it's salt free. I'm just not a fan of adding a ton of sodium to our food. I think that food does need a little bit of salt but I don't think that it needs as much as a lot of the prepackaged taco and fajita seasonings ha usually have in them. So that's why I kind of like to rely on Mrs. Dash for a lot of things. I also really like Trader Joe's seasonings. I really think that they do a good job of including just like core herbs and spices and not like extra stuff. I picked up some Newman's Own salsa. Again, I love Newman's Own brand because I can read all the ingredients on the back and I I just like to buy stuff if it's gonna be prepackaged where I can read the ingredients and understand what's in there I'm not a big fan of reading things and it's chemically and full of sodium and full of other stuff that I don't know what it is because I'm not a chemist okay we're home from the grocery store and we've eaten lunch and hi we're all hanging out and chilling a little bit before quiet time but I kind of wanted to show you something <laughs> so I walked up behind Louisa and I was like what is on her legs and I was like oh my goodness what's wrong with her legs what's on your legs 
It's... And then I was like, wait a second. What did you have for lunch? It's blackberries. And then I started wiping it off. And it's blackberries. She had blackberries for lunch and must have gotten them all over her legs. I thought they were bruises or some weird rash. <laughs> I started panicking and then I realized that they wipe off. <laughs> so, you silly girl, did you have blackberries for lunch? Yes. Yes. Yeah, it was on your leg. Yes. Anyway, it is super hot out today, so we're chilling out, watching a movie before quiet time, and apparently being angry on the couch. Oh, three and a half. Such a hard age. And yeah, that's really it. I did rent the, the big kids a special movie to watch after Nicholas gets home from school, because I had a red box code. Um, I haven't, we haven't seen it yet, but hi, Spin Elsa. Blah, blah, blah. So, I think I'm going to work on some wreath stuff. I don't know if you've seen my wreath page, but you should check it out. Um, it's called Savvy Home Accents. I have an Etsy page as well as a regular.com page, so um, I'll put the links in the description below. But go ahead and check them out. I sell really reasonably handmade, uh, customizable wreaths. This is one that I'm currently selling. And then it's, it's baseball season still so here. Go Cubs. I'm working on finishing this baseball wreath see it so but I could do any team and this one is in more of like a sparkly mesh so it's a little smaller than the other one but it's still pretty big around and then I also sell this one which is currently on our front door I don't know if you've been following the media today but unfortunately a local police officer was shot and I believe killed and there is a manhunt underway for several suspects it's not Super close to our house, but it's not super far. So, it's a little bit scary. My chicken fajitas. So, my one, I call them one, two, three chicken fajitas because it's just three ingredients in the crock pot. But look how yummy they look. Did you see that steam? Mm -hmm. Super yummy. And when they're done, I'm just going to shred them up, serve them on tortillas with some cheese and lettuce and sour cream and tomatoes just like you would feed us. I'll fry up some, probably fry up some peppers and onions. And that's it. I will bake a couple plain chicken breasts just for the kids with like garlic salt and stuff on them um, because these might be a little spicy for them. We'll see what daddy thinks of them. He's not a big fan of spicy but they do smell super yummy so we'll see. But yeah, quick and easy weeknight meal. Um, chicken breasts, a jar of salsa, any taco or fajita seasoning you like, throw it all in the crock pot, run it on low, around 8 hours or so, 8 to 10 hours, just shred the chicken up, and it's good to go. Just put it on some tortillas. Oh my gosh, you guys, I just realized today is actually September 1st, which means I have to change the calendar. I absolutely love this calendar. This is one of those like mom's calendars, and basically everybody gets a column, and it comes with these really cool stickers. So they say things like half day, vacation, and you can kind of just stick them. So like for example, Audrey, like for example, Audrey has dance class on Saturdays. So if you can see that, it's a really great way to keep track of everything without having to write everything like in one square or one block. And then it's up for everyone to see in the family or anyone who's here. I just really like it. It's super easy. I've been using this calendar for two or three years. So. Yeah, that's the calendar. I'll put an Amazon link below for you to pick one. I'll put an Amazon link below for you to pick one up. I highly, highly recommend it. All right, so Nicholas is home from school, and I showed them the movie that I rented them on the Red Box this morning. It's Home. It's a DreamWorks movie. I don't really know anything about it. I think it got pretty good reviews. So we'll see what the kids think. Nicholas, can you say hi to the vlog for the first time today? Say hi. 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 Audrey, okay. they're eating cheese sticks. They love cheese sticks, so yeah, I think we're going to give this movie a try and see. So I'll let you know what they think, and then I'm going to work on um, today's vlog and get it up for you. Okay, guys, so I've pretty much finished making dinner. We're just waiting for Daddy to get home to start eating. But I wanted to show you um, the kids are actually working on, well, Nicholas is working on his homework. So mm. what are you drawing, bud? 
I had to draw five cheese, but I accidentally made them bigger. That's okay. You just draw one up here. But so, that can be the fish. So it's kind of cool the way that Nicholas's kindergarten teacher does homework is she sends home a packet. So there's one sheet for every night of the week. You have a shirt. Louisa has a shirt. That's a PJ shirt. We'll put that on at night night time, okay? So basically they send it home on Monday, and then there's one sheet for every night, Monday through Thursday, and then you send it back on Friday. So everybody's had their snack, and we're going to eat dinner in a few minutes, and Audrey's drawn her Doc McSuffins. She's drawing an A. She's drawing an A for her name. She's practicing. Oh, that's pretty good, Audrey. Hey. Good job. Ta-da! So yeah, that's it. What did you guys think of the movie? What did you think of the movie Home? Good. Was it good? What was your favorite part? Uh, my favorite part was when that. they built the car. When they built the car? Uh, does that look like a bee? That looks like a bee. Let's see that bee. What do you think? Okay. Looks like a pretty good bee. Let's hold it up and see. Looks like a pretty good bee to me. How many more do you need to draw? Uh, three. You got three total, but you already have one. How many more? Two. That's right. Good job. That's adding. And Audrey is drawing Doc McStuffins all red. It's okay. Next one is pink. Oh, it's pink. It's so, yeah. What? So, that's kind of really it for the day. Daddy's going to come home. We're going to eat dinner and then um, just hang out as a family and then go to bed. So, thanks for watching today. I hope you really enjoyed it. Um, click subscribe. I think it's technically up here. Um, or it's up here somewhere. Anyway, click subscribe and um, like the video and comment. And we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. See you tomorrow. Can you bye, say, Grandma. Bye. Can you say see you tomorrow? Bye, so see you tomorrow. Bye. Can I make a funny face in it? Bye. Ah. Louisa, here, you take us out. Louisa. Louisa. Louisa, can you say bye? Bye. bye. You're perfect in the perfect way. You're perfect and I hope you stay. Your goofy little self eternally. Whoa. I'm weird like you, I know it's true. I'm in the clouds up there with you. You think you're flawed, but wouldn't you agree? You're perfect for me.